I'm going to show you how to get the secret treasure at the stables in uh, Star Wars Jedi Survivor. So there's a stables at Rambler's Reach Outpost on Kobo right here. And there's a secret item that you can only get with a very special trick. So you see that mountain. I don't, even, I don't know what their names are, but you see that. And you got to pay attention to what color he is. So what you'll do is you'll go into here, uh, into um, Pyloon Saloon. And you'll rest at this meditation point. And then after you rest at this meditation point, you'll come back and you'll check to see what mounts are in the stables. Now, this is probably not the only way to do this, but uh, you could probably just go get a mount and bring it here if you find the right one. So with neither of these ones, we're looking specifically for a pink mount. So we're just going to go back and forth, resting over and over and over again until we see a pink mount. Though so this might take a few rotations. We'll have to see here. It just depends on your luck, the RNG, all that, you know? Ironically, the first time I ever came here, there was a pink one. I had no idea whether there was anything special about it, but I definitely saw it and thought it was really cool looking. Makes me think of when I had, I played Ark Survival Evolved and I had a pink dinosaur as my first dinosaur ever. I named it Ruby and then it Let's died. Moving, buddy. Okay, hopefully there'll be a pink one this time. Still no pink one, unfortunately. You'll know when there's a pink one. It's it's very, very, very obvious when there's a pink one. All right, so let's go back in here again and rest again. All right, let's see what we get this time. Still no pink one, unfortunately. All right, let's rest again. Alright, this will be the one, I believe. This will be it. Still no pink one. So I've reset like 10 more times and there's still no pink one. But there is this strange purple one. I wonder if this purple one will do it also. Um, I've never even seen one this color before. So what you're going to do is you're going to go over here to the stables. You're going to put your Neko in here and you're going to get off. If you already have one in here, you're going to take your old one. And then you're going to get it out of the stables and jump off. And then just to make sure that it actually puts it in, you're going to get on it again and then walk out and walk back in. You're just there we go. Just make sure. Idea. All right. And then I'm going to reset it and make sure. I don't know. I'll be. It'll be awesome if this one can also do it. I know the pink one can do it, but I've never tried a purple one. I've never even seen a purple one, to be honest. This is kind of crazy. I didn't know there were so many colors for these guys. All right. Let's see if the purple one is going to do it for us as well. Could just be any crazy colored one, because there's also like some obnoxious neon like colored ones. Wow, so the purple one does it too. So it's not just a pink one, the purple ones also. It might just be any of the crazy colored ones. Like when you see that green one, or maybe when you see like a really bright blue one or something, you could try them. Just try different ones. But either way, once you get one that will work, it will eventually have this, and you'll interact with this, which you'll only be able to do once you get later on in the game. So you actually won't be able to do this until a little bit later on in the game. You'll eventually get ability to pick things up or slam things with the force, and you'll need that in order to pick that up, apparently. Well, either way, that was it, a Pryrite Shard. So that is the secret treasure, guys. That is the only way to get that in order to 100% this area. This is the um, Rambler's Reach area. So if you want 100% the Rambler's Reach area, you're going to have to get your neck out of poop. But either way, there you guys go. That is how to get the secret treasure at the stables in Star Wars Jedi Survivor.